Let me show you how to use rapid tap feature on a Steel Series keyboard. And to do this, uh, first we'll need to open our Steel Series GG engine and uh, then select your keyboard. Now we need to go to actuation and uh, there's a rapid tap right here. When uh, we select behavior, we can switch between four different options. And I'm gonna go through each of them and show you example in the game. So uh, now when uh, we actually deactivate it, and uh, let's say that we have our row keyboard without the, that rapid tap option, uh, when we move around and click A and D that you can see registering on the screen, uh, when I hold A and then press D, I just stop. Now when we try to activate rapid tap with last input priority and select key one as A and uh, key two as D, we can save those settings then go back to the game. Now when I hold A and then start pressing and holding D, instead of uh, stopping, I will move to the right. So that's how you can use the first uh, preset. Now let's uh, get through the rest of them. Uh, where's the Steel Series right here? And then next one is Priority Key 1, and you can click on this info button to read through them. Priority Key 1 will take a priority over Key 2, so now our key one has overall priority above key two and the rest of them if you plan on adding more. And now let's save it. And uh, what will change is uh, when I hold A and press D, I will keep moving to the left instead of uh, moving to the right. Now let's uh, go for uh, priority key two and this will work the same way but uh, instead of uh, when I press D and then hold A I will keep moving to the right as a D has priority now let's go to neutral and this will basically reset your uh, settings and uh, your keyboard will work the same so now when we hold A and then tap D and hold it we'll just uh, stop so that is basically how we can use the rapid uh, tap in a steel series keyboard.